Hello guys, so here. hope you're having a wonderful day of non back relax and enjoy the video. Now today guys, we are back with our Poke Jewel Let's Play and today's episode people, we shall be heading to the next island, uh, Two Island I think it's called. I completely forgot how this whole Savior Island business works. So yeah, we're here at the Sailor, uh, gonna go to, yeah, Two Island I guess that's the name, yeah, Two Island. I'm not too sure what's there. Uh, I know one of the islands has Team Rocket and one of the islands has the Hypno situation. I think this one has the Team Rocket. Judging by its looks, I'm not too sure, but I think this one also has a has a. Uh, whoa, whoa, what did he say? There's another one who lives in a cottage out on the Cape. She gives the eye to Pokemon. It's a bit unnerving. Okay, I can't cut this because. Hold on, wait. I can use the PC here though, right? Oh, I thought I could cheese the system. I'm not gonna lie. I honestly thought I could. See, th this is what I'm saying. So you have to be so ready. <laughs> for this like if you're gonna nuzlocke it so yeah oh okay cool so those goons we have to take out. i remember when i played through cloud wipe when i had to take on those goons big mushroom i don't have any apparently i sold them all i think uh i remember taking on those goons in pokemon cloud white and there was a celebi and a mew uh, in the area oh it was crazy Oh, this is rough as well. Say, for example, you're low on freaking items as well. Oh, this is rough. Uh, what's going on here? It just froze. Okay. I guess I... No, it didn't. The game... Okay, cool. I'm so lucky. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. <laughs> I'm not joining you, bro. Nah, move, move, move. Why is this here? Just for fishing? Hold on, we're not battling you just yet. Petten? What is that? Insect Queen? Ugly. Alright, let me switch my starter out front, actually. So then, I predicted... I perfected the ultimate move of its type. But will no one take future use from you? That No, that red eyes. No, I was just mistaken. What? Hey, right, do you want to talk shit? Don't talk shit on my red eyes. What? What about you, bro? What is Bozo here? Alright, you you can go do yourself, mate. Alright, cool. So what's in here? Mr. Darts. Not darts, I uh, Raphael. I have only the purpose and that is to collect souls for darts. People like you disrespect their cards, make me sick. We we're literally talking about this guy in the last episode. Get ready because I'm going to take your soul away. Activate Celestial Sword. Is he gonna have the seal of Oracalcos? Would that be a card? Uh, a monster. Do you guys think so? Do you think there's a Oracalcos? Uh, what's it called? Oh, what's it called? Possessed uh, monsters? I think that would be sick. Okay, big show gardener. I guess we lead out with obelisk, so that's super effective. Cool, cool, cool. But yeah, uh, I hope... Oh my god. I did not expect you to get counter. That is very cheesy. Imagine if I was Nuzlocke and I lost my obelisk to counter from... Uh, Gardner. Oh my god, I'd be so pissed off. So pissed. Alright, Karib Babylon. We got Powder Snap and we got Rollout, I guess. I guess. Oh my god. Yo. Why is your Karib Babylon so big? Alright, cool. Well, I guess. You know, frick me, it's fine. Did I, I didn't want my Pokemon anyway. I should have Guardian Iatos. This is his ace, of course. Rock Slide. Nice. Should one shot. Sound some rages. Cool. He doesn't use any sound magician. Cool. Oh, it's psychic type. What am I doing? Um, I guess we'll go for the red eyes actually, because you are dark, mate. Nice. There we go. Cool. What does he say? You guys can hear the plane outside. I swear. I don't know why, but for like the last month, there's been so many disturbances when recording and streaming outside. I don't know. Gardenatos will always look after me. Good to know. Is there any items in here? Is there a potential Yu-Gi-Oh card on there? No. Okay. It's fine. So I can't do anything here other than that. So it's Free Island. That's where all the shenanigans goes down, pretty much. But this is good for encounters when Nuzlocke, though. You can fish here. You can say, even if it... Hold on. Can you fish? No, you can't. Ah, oh, I was going to say. This is, like, the perfect place for it. Okay, cool. Let me put my super rod back to. Hold on, let me put this all the way in purple just in case I accidentally. F 
do something with the master ball that I shouldn't be doing. Um, but yeah, I, I registered the super rod so I could get the Leviathan. Put it back to the bicycle. Did they change the... Oh, they might have changed the bicycle theme. I haven't actually read the bicycle. Hold on. No. I hated the bike theme uh, for this. Hey, lady, fork off some spending money. Who are you? I I'll call the police. I hope you're not talking to me, lady. Okay, let's see. Free Isle Path. There might be some rare Pokemon here, so I'm not gonna... Actually, no, I don't think there's any Pokemon in here. I'll show you this for you. <gasps> Nugget! Nice! Is there a legendary Pokemon here? Is it? Like... Okay, maybe not. Oh, Relinquished! I will capture this. This is actually a pretty cool Pokemon. A monster. Oh, I need to use the Monster Ball. Imagine. Imagine. Solid card, though. It's pretty strong. I remember someone used it uh, against me on stream. I think it was Groovy. And I beat him. Alright, nice to know there's an aeroplane and a dog barking outside. I'm gonna close this window. Okay. You know, I hate having to close my window when recording because it just makes my room hot, bro. Like, I don't want it to be hot enough. You know what I'm saying? I just record normally, bro. Okay, cool. Relinquish, that's fine. Alright, Obelisk, I don't think we're gonna use you. Like, you're literally there just to body anyone that could potentially pose a threat to the team. <laughs> and you're level 50. That's also why. I just want to rank up Fortress well, and then or level up with Fortress well, and put Leviathan on the team and grind him up off screen. Ah, oh, bro, the Sprite for Leviathan is so cool, so so cool. It's not, it's not even an actual Yu-Gi-Oh card actually. Come to think of it, it's not right. I'm gonna have to search that up on Google to see if there's an actual card. I don't think it's an actual card because obviously in the anime, it's uh, attack points is infinity, which is impossible. Oh, the PC works here. <gasps> Okay, cool. Well, what I wanted to do, look at that. How beautiful. What type of Dragon fire. Oh my god, that is fire. No pun intended. Flame for Okay, not a bad moveset. Don't know why you got peg. You should have. Okay, hold on. Grass dark. Oh, uh, continue. Look how cool this looks, bro. You cannot tell me that doesn't look cool. Uh, okay, deposit obelisk because I'm going to give the XP share to Leviathan. So now we can use it. So what's the point then? <laughs> is Team Rocket not here then? I could have sworn they were here. Or is it post post, like actual post game they're here? Because you can come to these islands once the game is done. Once you're done with the game. Okay, controller disconnected. Cool. Anyway, 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 anyway. Cool. Wow, lots of uh, trainers here, huh? I don't think I told you guys about my time in Manchester because I was out of town actually for a little bit. So I'm going to tell you my time about my time in Manchester. No, I didn't mean to level you up. This. I was meant to use that on uh, Leviathan, but okay, it's fine. 27 as well, solid level. Would be nice if it was in fact. Are you the boss? Go back to Kanto Rant right now, huh? I just got here, pal. What's with that hostile attitude? It's mighty cold of you. Your gang of followers have been raising havoc. Okay, cool. Anyway, back to our same. So, uh, Manchester, amazing time. I needed it. Super stressed out with work and content, like really really stressed out i really really needed that and it cleared my clear mind it cleared my mind pretty much um it was so fun so fun it was so good to see my best friend and good to see his housemates his girlfriend like because i met them so i've met his girlfriend twice and i've met his housemates once and it was before their housemates it was last year for his birthday right and yeah they were really chill really lovely people very nice great hosts you know I was a, I, you know something, even his girlfriend said I was the best guest. And I wasn't doing this on purpose just so they can say I'm the best guest or something. It's just me, I'm just a helpful guy, I'm really kind in general. So like, I'd help out with the house, I'd help out with their shopping, but like, yo, do you guys need anything from the supermarket? I'll get it for you, this, this and that. Even though I was quite skint going there, um, I don't care, you know, he, he's my friend. And also they're students. You know, it's not like, they're not like me. I don't pay bills. They pay bills. So I'll happily help them out. I know the struggle of being a student, living in student housing. Do you get what I'm saying? I know how difficult it can be. You know what I'm saying? So any type of help I could have given them, I wanted to. You know, their house was all, like, also they could, obviously young guys, teenagers, can be a bit lazy. So I did some cleaning, like in terms of like the fridge was like, not the freezer, like the freezer, the it's weird how they're freezers. So there's a, the freezer door, and then there's a door covering the freezer door. And the inside of the freezer door was like, had stains, and the freezer door itself had stains. So I just wiped that down, made it squeaky clean, all nice and white. 
you know, like good okay, kills. <laughs> I'm joking, but um, yeah. But enough about that. It, it was a great time, um, and also, I'm the best guest actually. Come to think of it, because my friend's girlfriend lost her Nike Air Forces, and so I was sleeping in a spare bedroom, and apparently it's her bedroom. Uh, she uses it, but it's pretty much a spare bedroom. And her Air Forces was like behind the bed and slightly under it. I only found this the day I left Manchester and um, while I was, because the charger was behind the bed for my phone. So I was getting the charger and I see something black. I'm like, what's that? And I see it's a black Air Force. And she literally said, has anyone seen my black Air Forces? So I found it and then I just left them in the room and I messaged her. I was like, yo, I got your, I found your thingies. And she's like, oh my God, no way. <laughs> Um, but yeah, anyway, enough about that. We went to some bar. Uh, it was a retro arcade gaming bar. It was so sick. I'm going to try to put the videos up on screen. If I forget to, it means I forgot while editing. But bro, it was sick. I, I don't know if I put it in my Discord. Regardless, it was so cool. Like, bunch of arcade machines. Um, with Street Fighter, Tekken, uh, Sonic, Simpsons. The, the zombie game when you got the retro arcade plastic guns the pink and the blue one ah oh, bro it was so cool so so cool they had a gamecube playstation one and a super nintendo all hooked up to three different tvs and the super nintendo had mario kart the uh gamecube had that mario kart double dash and the super nintendo had, uh, the ps1 had uh street fighter right and uh they had they also had what's the sega console Oh, was it the Dreamcast? I don't know. They had some a Sega console. I know they did. It was on a different part of the room or the floor, whatever you want to call it. And yeah, it was so sick. It was so, so cool. I was like, oh my God, this place. Because my friends, I remember one time he faked my best friend. So he FaceTimes me, right? And out of the blue, like out of the blue. And he says, yo, I wanted to show you this. And he's at the, the gaming bar. And I was like, what? I said to him, next time I come, we're going there. And he's like, say less, we're going. And Jerry went, and it was like, how much was it? Was it seven pounds uh, for 16 chips? Each arcade machine costs one or two chips to play, so you, I'd say it's fairly decent, the amount you get and the amount you can play <laughs> using them. Do you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, and the first machine we went on was Tekken. And I've never talked about Tekken with my friend. I don't think I've ever talked about Tekken in general, but that game was my shit back in the day. When I was a kid, I used to play that game, uh, believe it or not. That's why when, I remember I was in Big Stream, uh, Kazuya, I think his name is, or Yakuza, I don't know, I got announced, I instantly recognized him, I was like, that's Tekken, and he was really in chat, he was like, who's this character, who's this character, and I said, he's from Tekken, and he was like, Tekken, and as soon as he said that, it came up on the screen, from Tekken, <laughs> and um, yeah, uh, and I, I beat him pretty badly, and he was like, you're a nerd, you're a nerd, no, 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 I was like, a bro. I, haven't, I played this on the PS1 and the PSP. I, I know how to play this game. I haven't played it in years though. He said, oh, you're a nerd, you're a nerd. And we played Street Fighter after, right? So we, obviously we rematched on Tekken. I smacked, I beat him, right? We go to the Street Fighter machine. I I'm, Call me uncultured. I've actually never played Street Fighter until that day, right? I beat him. And he was so mad. He was like, you nerd, you're a nerd, you're a nerd. I'm like, my guy. I have, I, I've never played this game. I'm just good. What do you want me to do? <laughs> I don't know what you want me to do. Like, <laughs> let you in? Come on, bro. What are you, my little brother? And, um, ooh, who's that? Please stay away from me. I want to stay away from you. You're on your own. It's dangerous. I missed. Okay. It's possible. Oh, my God. That's so much damage. Dragon Breath. Yes, yes, yes. We need some stuff. Dragon moves. But yeah, it was so fun. And um, after that, I see... So after that is when I see the consoles. I didn't know they were there. I see Mario Kart Double Dash. My whole life was just, just flashed. I was like... I was so happy when I saw that. You guys may or may not know. I've mentioned it a lot of times. Oh, wait, you're what? No, 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 no. Anyway. <laughs> Risk it for that chalky biscuit, bro. I keep hiccuping. Why am I hiccuping? Uh... for but um, I saw it and I was so gassed up. I wanted to scream. I was like, oh my God, I've never been able to play a GameCube in my life. I've never been able to play um, that game as well. I was like, oh my God, finally. 
And it happened. I, I played those. Uh, I, I jumped on the same time as these group of boys, right? Uh, guys, they were like fully grown men. And the guy was like, ah, oh, are you playing? I was like, no, nah, no, nah, jump on, bro. And we played each other. And my best friend, I'm going to call him by his actual name, Daryl, okay? I call all my friends by their actual names. Daryl, okay? Daryl is his name, right? So Daryl taps me on the shoulder, speaks to my ear. He was like, yo, you better win this. I just bet uh, you'd win for a drink. And I was like, why would you do that? I'm in first the whole time. For, I think it was just as the third lap began. I fall off the map and the guy catches up. I finish fifth and he finishes in first or second. I forgot. And then he says to me, you're like Daryl. He's like, you're shit. I'm like, bro, were you not watching? You're standing behind me. Were you not watching what just happened? You don't witness the bullshit, mate. I was just like, oh, piss off. And then there's yeah, so many hidden items here. It's unreal. And then I was like, bro, what do you want me to do? So someone else jumps on. I play them. I beat them, actually. So yeah, Daryl. Fuck you. <laughs> Joking. But um, yeah, I, I, I beat them. And then there's a couple next to us. Right? So do, these guys go. And then me and Daryl play against each other. We're just chilling. It's not that competitive. We're literally just chilling back playing at this point. And um, okay, so the nonce that is Hypno is here. Uh, scare Pokemon. Uh, uh, uh. Here it comes again. Go away. It's scaring me. Okay, what Pokemon is this then? <gasps> I want to capture you. I found you last time. I didn't get to capture you, so I will capture you this time. Nice. Perfect health for a Great Ball. Okay, maybe not. Great Ball. Nice. I found the dragon. Cool. Lost out. Yeah. Oh, he gives me something, right? Oh, that's it. He's doing this for me. There we go. So let me chat to him, and I think we're done with the island. Or two islands unlock, and that's where Team Rocket is. I don't know, a Moonstone? I did all of that for a Moonstone, you're kidding. Okay, I'll hold on to the Moonstone. I always wanted to play this as a kid, actually. Pokey Jump. I really want to play this as a kid. I'm not even gonna die to. I've never played. Does, has anyone ever played that those game modes? But anyway, so okay, back to the story. We're chilling, and there's a couple next to us, and the guy is getting beat. I'm looking on their side, and she's like, his girlfriend is celebrating, like proper rubbing it in his face. Us, and I'm joking with him. I'm like asking like about what's going on. I just bust a few jokes here and there, and then um, he was like, "Oh, bro, she's mental." And then we swap. So me and, me and Daryl, we play uh, the PlayStation 1, they play the Mario Kart. And then um, the guy, the boyfriend, we sw I swap him with Daryl. I play against him. We're chilling. I beat him on Street Fighter. I beat Daryl on Street Fighter as well uh, on the PS1. And that was Daryl shit. He was telling me like he played this as a kid. I didn't and I beat him. I'm not joking with you. And then uh, he swaps and then the girlfriend comes. And I say to her, yo, um, so we, we, we're playing and I'm like... Uh, I beat those two guys, so you have a good match. And she's like, okay, this, that. And um, she was really lovely, though. Uh, but she was a bit cocky, which was funny. That was the best part of it. That's what made it fun, right? Um, and she's like, hold on, I promise. Hold on. Okay, cool. So, I play her. Bro, I swear to God, she was cracked. Like, she was so good at the game. Like, she smacked me. I'm not even, like, I got bodied. I, we played three matches against each other. I lost every single one. Like, in one of those, I won, like, one of the rounds because it's best of three in the matches. But, oh, my God. Like, she was so good. And I just couldn't believe it. I was like, wow. And I don't know what she did because Daryl didn't do it. The guy didn't do it. But as soon as the game began, she did something to damage me instantly as the game began. So she knew something. I said to her, what are you doing? You're... you're you're cheating, like, what are you doing? She's like, I don't know, I'm not doing anything. I'm just like, I don't know, I'm not pressing anything. Bullshit, lady, all right? Don't, don't, don't bullshit me. I'm not drunk, I don't drink, yeah? So I'm not going to be stupid enough to fool. So when we finished the second one, she's like, if you beat me in the next one, you have to buy me a drink. And I was like, yeah, yeah, whatever. I wasn't going to do it anyway. And she beats me, and she, look, all smiling at me, she's like, I think you owe me a drink now, and then me being the rat I am, so, take notes, people, if you want to become a rat, uh, I laugh it off, and I'm like, yo, and I get Daryl's attention, I'm like, yo, play her, she's really good, and then, 
He plays her. I escape, not having to buy anything. And then, lo and behold, I'm playing the, the boyfriend at Marika. I beat him, okay? But it's more fun as well. Like, we're just chilling. And then, she gets up from the seat and goes. That will comes to him. He's like, I just want us drinks. I was like, wait, what? I was like, what do you mean? And he's like, I, I made a bet with her if I beat her and I beat her. I was like, you're kidding. And he was like, yeah, I beat her. I was like, no, you didn't beat her. I was like, no, seriously, I beat her. And I was like, was she good? And he was like, no, she wasn't that good. I was like, are you kidding? He beat her twice, apparently. They played two matches and he beat her. And yeah, I got Red Bull. Daryl got, I don't know what al the alcohol was, but yeah. <laughs> fun, fun night. There was so many other stuff. It was good. Good night, good night. Um, and you could buy their uniform. It was really, really cool. Like, it was a Nike tick in the middle of the shirt. You know the plain shirts? Nike shirts and a big Nike tick in the middle. And it had the name of the bar in Nike. Uh, uh, what's it called? Font. It was so cool. And you could buy it, but I didn't end up buying it in the end. But my Daryl was going to buy it for me and bring it here. Anyway, when he comes back to London. Because I was going to buy it on the, last, uh, the day before I went uh, back to London. But we didn't end up going out. But yeah. Anyway, 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 anyway. Manchester was amazing. I got holiday blues the next morning I woke up. I actually felt uh, so upset leaving there. It was such a good time. But anyway, that's the end of today's episode. Quite an eventful episode, I guess. I don't know. Uh, was it this episode we caught? Well, uh, anyway. That's the end of today's episode. Hope you all did enjoy. If you did, be sure to hit like button below. And feel free to, the, to subscribe to the channel if you're new and you want to see more Pokemon content like this. Be sure to follow me on Twitter, like my Facebook page, all of it in the description below. As well as my Twitch if you want to see Yu-Gi-Oh! content. And it's also on screen. And uh, the Discord is down there. And the playlist for Pokejewel if you missed out on the episodes. And yeah, once again, thank you guys ever so much for watching. I love you all. Stay safe. I love you all. Have a wonderful day.